Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe, like the video if you like it, and share the friend if you might need it. This video is posted by someone down in the comments, so if you have something like me to do, leave it down in the comments and I'll check it out. So for this song, the guitar is going to be in standard tuning and it's just going to be an open string, so you don't need a capo. First thing you're going to start off with is going to be the verse. First thing you're going to play is going to be a C sharp. So for that, it's going to be 5th string, 4th fret, 4th string, 6th fret, 3rd string, 6th fret, and 2nd string, 6th fret. I'm gonna play down, up, down, up. Then go to a F sharp minor. That's gonna be sixth string, second fret, fifth string, fourth fret, third string, fourth fret, third string, second fret, second string, second fret. So the same looking pattern here as well. And then you go to a B chord. B chord is gonna be the same thing as a C sharp. Just move it down two frets. Same sort of pattern here. And then you go to a A sharp minor. That's gonna be fifth string, first fret, fourth string, third fret, third string, third fret, second string, second fret. Same strum pattern here as well. And then go to a G sharp. That's gonna be sixth string, fourth fret, fifth string, sixth fret, fourth string, sixth fret, third string, fifth fret, second string, fourth fret. Same strum pattern. And then go to a D sharp minor. So that's gonna be fifth string, sixth fret, fourth string, eighth fret, third string, eighth fret, second string, seventh fret. Same string pattern here as well. And then go back to the G sharp. You strum down, up, and then you play a G sharp seven. Pretty much the same thing you're playing right now. Just take your finger off fourth string, and then same thing, down, up, and then you play a C sharp. Sus four, so that's gonna be fifth string, fourth fret, fourth string, sixth fret, third string, sixth fret, and second string, seventh fret. Strum down once, and then you go to a C sharp, and then strum down. And then for the verse, you're just gonna repeat that whole progression two times. So for the chorus, you're gonna start with the A sharp minor. You're gonna play down, up. And then repeat it one more time. So, then G sharp, play it down, up, and then C sharp, play it down, up, and then D sharp minor, down, up, C sharp, down, up, G sharp, down, up, and then G7. So, that's how that chorus part sounds like. And then you pretty much repeat the whole thing one more time and then it goes like the little instrumental part before the next verse. So for the little instrumental part, start with a C sharp, you play down, up, but that four times, so And then go to a D sharp minor seven. Pretty much gonna be the same as a D sharp minor. Just take your finger off third string and play down, up, down, up. And then after you play the D sharp minor seven, you go to a D minor seven. Pretty much same thing you play right now. Just move that one fret. Play down, up. Then go to a C minor seven again. Same thing you play right now. Just move it down two frets. Play it down, up, then repeat the whole thing over again. So start with the C sharp, and then play it four times. And then after you play the C sharp chord four times, you go to an F sharp major seven. Play that's gonna be sixth string, second fret, fourth string, third fret, third string, third fret, second string, second fret. Play it down, up, four times. Then go on to the next verse. So for the next verse, start off with a C sharp. You play the same chord you played in the play the same sharp pattern you played in the first verse. So down, up, down, up. So F sharp, pretty much gonna be the same as the F sharp minor. Just put your finger on third string, third fret. Then G sharp. 
D-sharp minor, then F-sharp, F and then G-sharp, then D minor, then G-sharp once, then G-sharp 7 once, and then the one that's C-sus-4, to a C sharp. Then you go on to the next chorus. And then next chorus is gonna be played the same way we played the previous chorus and then go on to the outro. Outro is still the D minor. You play the strong pattern twice. So down, up, down, up, then G sharp, down, up, C sharp, down, up. Then repeat that for three more times. So in general, you're going to be playing that progression four times for the outro. And then after you play that, you're going to play D sharp minor two times. And then you're going to play C sharp sus four. Then C sharp. And that's how the song ends. So this is how the whole song sounds like all together.
If this video helped, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe to more videos like this, share it to a friend think you might need it, leave a comment down below on what to like to see next, and I'll see you next time.